Hello, Carrie Lane here with Dia TV, and we're at the opening night for the Third Eye Film Festival here at the Roxy Theater in San Francisco. Third Eye, San Francisco International South Asian Film Festival, celebrated their 21st year at the independently owned Roxy Theater. This is a hundred year old theater, and so we love to support it, and I think a weekend here is a good idea. And the location wasn't the only independent factor. There were no films from Bollywood this year, as programming focused more on independent cinema. <laughs> While We Watched kicked off the festival with a sold-out screening. Last year, because it was sort of post-COVID, we really went for humor and comedy. And this year, I think there's a different sort of sense of more deeper films dealing with politics. My film is a newsroom drama. It chronicles Ravish Kumar, who's a news anchor in India. So it chronicles the last couple of years uh, that he spent at NDTV. And it's reflective of the crisis that journalism faces across the world with budgetary cuts, uh, with staff leaving, and with very often you facing the challenge of having to report uh, against the mainstream belief of even the people, not just governments. Fresh off their Audience Choice Award for Best Feature Win at the Indian Film Festival of Los Angeles, the Golden Thread director Nishta Jain loves the different approach Third Eye takes. I think the audience and how they respond to the films, it's very, uh, uh, you know, layered and the conversations that we have about the films are very engaging. So I think that's what, that's what draws me here. Third Eye has long been a showcase for established and independent filmmakers alike, especially those on the bleeding edge of storytelling. I'm in, born and raised in India and it's great to connect with this community of filmmakers who are from the diasporic communities and are living here and filmmakers who are, you know, living in South Asia and just see the diversity of the films, the talent and just like South Asian brilliance and ingenuity. They are just so uncompromising in their curatorial eye. You know, every year they pay so much attention to the most important thing, which is bringing really beautiful, exceptional films to the Bay Area. For Dia TV Spotlight, I'm Carrie Lane in San Francisco.